bought this yesterday. New protein. I actually have not made a protein shake at home in so long, and you guys know that used to be like my thing. Go to the gym, make a smoothie, drink my smoothie in the shower. It was a whole routine, and I've been off of it for a while. But now, since I've been lifting more in the gym, I've been craving a protein shake, so I needed to restock. I've never tried this one before. It is the Garden of Life Creamy Protein with Oat Milk Powder in the vanilla cookie flavor. I haven't found a protein that I'm like in love with, but I feel like I was spending so much money like buying all different ones, so I just wanted to get a big tub of one that has good ingredients. And if it tastes bad, you know what? We're just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> now that is a smoothie. That's thick, but delicious. I decided not to do like peanut butter and stuff in it, just do straight fruit and have it be more like refreshing. Done out of 10. I have had to come to terms with the fact that I am not very good at time management. I try to plan out my days like in my head and I'm not good at following that. It causes me to be late to things. It causes me to, to skip things that I was planning on doing because I ran out of time to do them. So what is helping me that I've shared with you guys before is my structured app. You're just scheduling out different things throughout your day, putting the timestamp on them. You can also color coordinate them. It also connects to my Apple watch. So I, anything time I check it I can have like my next task on there whatever I'm supposed to be doing do I follow it to a T yes somewhat honestly most of the time it's for like reminding me of little things that I really need to do and making sure that I just somewhat stay on schedule and on time and it really really helps me get everything on my to-do list done because even if I run out of time for things like sometimes that just inevitably happens I'm able to go back in and right away reschedule them and make time for it so that I make sure that those things get done. Maybe you guys are like, Lindsay, yeah, that's literally what scheduling is and just like having a, a calendar and stuff. I use a calendar, but I don't always schedule out every little thing that I have to do, every little to-do list task. So having a place where I literally write everything and schedule everything and have it constantly be reminding me whether that's on my home screen or on my watch, I have been getting shit done and it's been amazing so i recommend the structured up my friend jacob is actually the one that showed it to me my blush combo i mean i've showed it to you guys before but i just need to say it again because it's been unmatched i cannot switch up from this blush right now my ysl lip and cheek tint in chills as my base and then i'll take the milk makeup queen water jelly tints and I'll do the tiniest bit on top and I feel like just a little bit of this one makes my blush pop so much more. It's, like I said, I cannot go without this combo. That'll do. I just need some gloss and honestly my life will be good. Thank you. We are just getting to the Century City Mall right now which is my favorite mall to shop at, especially when I am in a pinch and I need to find an outfit, like for sure, I will find it here. I need to find a wedding, I almost said a wedding dress. I need to find a dress to wear to a wedding, a wedding guest dress. Honestly, I've just been over online shopping i can't do it i love scrolling and i love looking but like just not being 100 percent sure on things and then getting them and they don't fit like i just don't love the process right now i just want to like shop in store and find something that i know i'll love have the dress and be done where am i going <laughs> anymore I, I have had some weird experiences with it but we're giving it another chance today because there's not many options here it'll do let's say you can take a bag of the barbecue 
see it from right here. I gotta spend four dollars on parking and I didn't even find a dress. I didn't even find what I came here for. I did run out of my face moisturizer, which I feel like I go through that stuff like crazy. So I bought the refillable pouch because I can fill up the bottle that I have, but also fill up my travel bottles as well. But it was like 75 bucks, but it'll be worth it. It's worth it. It's definitely the smarter purchase from with my money. Okay, I need to pay attention. Ah, okay, all right. <laughs> LA, it's such a thrill. It's about to fucking thunderstorm. It's about to thunderstorm. Outfit change. Nadia and I are gonna go get some din right now. Accompanied by a side of rain clouds that we didn't know we're gonna we're, show up tonight. We're beating the rain. The <laughs> rain will not stay away. Uh, <laughs> I'm so upset, it's okay. It's okay. it's okay, we love the rain. It's okay, we love it. We love mother nature. <laughs> just like curl my hair and cross my fingers. I think it was Blake Healy that posted a messy bun hair tutorial and it looks so cute on everyone. Today I just don't feel like recurling like my whole head of hair so we're gonna try it. This is kind of like your normal messy bun. All these pieces right here which you're gonna curl and then take these pieces and pin them back. It was time to get a new set, so I took up all my acrylics. We started fresh, and I just got this like really cute baby pink French tip set. I love getting white French tip, but I feel like sometimes, I don't know, the white like stands out a little bit too much, and I feel like the baby pink just makes it a lot like softer and lighter. I like it. And then here, do you guys see this? I'm gonna put you on to one of my all-time favorite places to get food from, and I don't go here often, because it is kind of expensive, but California Fish Grill has my heart. Oh my God, I get their salmon. You get two pieces of salmon. Sometimes I get half garlic butter, half Cajun, but I got double garlic butter today. Their Brussels sprouts and some white rice, and it's, oh my goodness. If you know, you know. If I'm by one, I have to get one every single time. It's so good. Today's the freaking day we find a dress for this wedding. I am making it my mission. We're gonna go to the mall and we're gonna find something, for sure. Thank you so much. Thank you. We said yes to the dress, but we said yes to the wrong dress in the beginning. I bought the cream dress because the green one was a little bit too big on me, but it was so gorgeous and they didn't have a smaller size. But when I left, I literally could not stop thinking about it. So I went back in and I exchanged the cream one for the green one. And then I took it to like a random alterations place to get it altered. And it literally will be ready in exactly a week, a day before the wedding. So fingers crossed that they do a good job. Joe's gone there before, so I'm, you know, I have high hopes. I'm glad I went back and got the green one because I fell in love with that one. It's from Reformation. I know it's just gonna last me a while and I'm gonna get it like fitted perfectly in my body. So I think it's a win-win. I forgot to show you guys. We never went through my little uh, goodies I got from the Ilya Beauty event last night. So let's see, I haven't taken a look. 
no peaks we're doing this together oh my gosh we fun we have a limitless lash mascara Ilia mascara the base face milk lightweight moisturizer this is what they launched so it's the skin rewind complexion stick this is what i got shade matched for so i got this in 22c and it says Ilia. that's adorable i think they shade matched me right and actually since i have fresh tanner on now i have a perfect match for summer for my, my little tan shade and then one of their blushes in dear ruby cute another perfect summer shade i also got another package this one let me know what you guys think about this you know that i don't drink i don't smoke i don't vape i don't do none of that but ripple reached out to me and these are aromatic diffusers and they look like vapes i don't exactly like they're it's a it's not a vape it's an aromatic diffuser it has extracts in it like green tea extract watermelon extract lime flower extract it's basically just a diffuser but there's no nicotine there's nothing like bad for you in it but This like freaked me out because I, I don't do any of this. So I'm like, that's kind of fun. So this one is Soothe. So it's honey and lemon aroma, ginger and chamomile. So it has ginger extract, chamomile extract. This one is free. So it's watermelon. This one's supposed to be good for inflammation, aids digestion, like, like it doesn't make any health or medical claims for the product, but like the extracts could help with those things. So I'm not saying like this is like a real cure for actually any of those things, but it could help. I don't know. I, I don't know. I just opened the package. I'm just trying the product. This one's delicious, the watermelon one. Ooh, it's kind of like cooling on my throat. I don't know, it's kind of fun. And this one is Old Mahogany Aroma. So dandelion root and black pepper. I think this one's supposed to be like an energizing one. I feel like this is gonna be fun because, you know, I be in the club and like I just have my little Diet Coke with me. And the one that's gonna like wake me up, like I get tired. I be tired when we're out and everyone's like up and like ready to go. And I'm like, you know, I start to clock out a little bit early. My little black pepper dandelion root wake me right up. I don't know. I'm not saying this is gonna be like a thing I'm just gonna start doing like all the time because I mean, you know, I don't really know much about it, but like you guys know me, I love aromas. I love diffusers. I love oils and extracts and stuff like that. So I'm open to it. I don't know, something new. This clip is honestly for everyone that doesn't like my little mini mic because I tried to use it in this clip and literally it didn't even plug in and now it just looks like I'm talking to myself. But anyways, my workout for today was just 30 minutes on the bike and then I did an ab circuit. Basically, I just did 15 of these, 15 of these ones, 15 on the other side, and then I did a 45 second plank with like hip twists and that had me dead. I just came back from a Zila fitness event. They just uh, launched their new like office with their DEXA scan. And it was cool. It was it was fun, but it took me so long to get home. I literally have 30 minutes to get ready before I need to leave to go to dinner with the girls. Yeah, we're kind of we're kind of a chaotic mess right now. I think I think I have 30 minutes. I've given my I haven't even mapped how long it's gonna take me to get there actually. Let's see. I have 20 minutes. We have 20 minutes. Not to freak you guys out, but we're in a bit of a rush. And I'm kind of um, a little stuck because I wore foundation today and it did not match my self tan so i need to either use the ilia one they just gave me which is risky because i don't know how it wears not saying it could be like bad but like it could just not sit right on my skin you know and like for the night and i usually don't ever do like stick foundations but i am gonna try their base face milk product because i feel like i can use anything that's gonna be moisturizing Nice. Okay. Cool. I don't know if I should do this. I don't know if this is going to be a good decision for us because I want to look good. 
Like, I want to look real good. You know what? We're going to say, fuck it, and trust the process. Because, you know, we have all these doubts. We're like, you know, it might not look good, but it also could look amazing. It could be, like, the best foundation that I've ever used, so let's trust the process. I honestly don't even know why I'm wearing this sweatshirt. I already have my top that I want to wear underneath this. It's from Boohoo. I just got it, actually. We want to be dancing tonight, so I want something that isn't going to make me all, like, you know, sweaty. So that's the thing to go. Honestly, this is better because I could see if this foundation matches. And honestly, they did a good job, I think. Also, guys, I'm using a new foundation in it. What do you think? I'm using the Ilia one. Thank you. Are you? Can you guys see? <laughs> No, you can't. It it's is. not the lighting. <gasps> there you go. Ilya. Ilya new foundation. You. Look at this. Honestly, us. though. Honestly? I'm fire. Yeah. <laughs> no, what I'm do you think about our makeup? Ilya. I love it. You look no, really honestly. good. <laughs> what did I first say to you when you walked to the front door? You said you like my blue top. And I said you, you look beautiful. Okay. I'm, just, I'm saying the face makeup, though. Like, you, you like it? I think you look beautiful. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Heavens on her. Hey yo, it's Rico. <laughs> you know Hannah Montana? Yeah. It's Buckeye Brown. Buckeye Brown. We Buckeye got the Buckeye peanut butter, Brownie. we got the chocolate. If you're not a fan of peanut butter chocolate, something's wrong. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Amazing? Yeah. Oh god, I thought you were saying bad. Come here. The best chocolate cookie. Wait, please look at the dough in that. Mm. I've been here once, but it's been a minute. That's legit cookie dough. Mm -hmm. You like that? Yeah, I love that. <laughs> you like that? You like that shit? The Bach brow. <laughs> you know I'm a fucking. If there's chocolate and peanut butter, it's over. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you got chocolate all over your teeth. True. I had You got chocolate all over your teeth. I suppose. Oh, I you love got it. Chocolate <laughs> Dude, the night hasn't even started. <laughs> it's like nine o'clock yeah, right now. Idea. Rumble. I felt bad for him. <laughs> That's not going in the vlog. You are not putting that That's in the vlog. That's not in the vlog. No.